Now let's talk about athletes who lose their crowns and title in Budapest World Athletic Championship 2023. To be honest, if you are really a track fan, then you will know that this year's um, World Athletic has been with a lot of ups and downs, like a lot of athletes could not regain their title and below are the or current as a world record holder or a former title holder. Now let's begin with the um, Bahamas um Shuna Uba. She lost her title in the 400 meter, but her reason for miss um for losing the war wa uh, title is understood table because um she came back five months later when she gave birth so this season has not been easy for the bahamian um superstar now let's move on to the next person on our list which is the south african 400 meter world record holder although i think um this guy did not win last year in oregon but still yet he is the world record holder and the most side of it is he was not able to regain his title as the world record holder he loses to one of um american european nations so so sad to the south african runner this year has not been um quite easy for him we remember that he is the former world rec he is the current world record holder but despite that he could not regain the title now let's move on to the next analyst atimu atimu elia loses her title in the 800 meter but her reason for losing the 800 meter title is understandable because we remember that before she was able to participate in the World Athletic Championship Budapest, her coach was deciding for her not to participate because her coach just felt like maybe she has a lot of injuries. So, due to people um, pressure and social media pressure, and Timu has no other choice but to participate. And after her participation, it is so sad that Atimu has lost her title as the former world champion and she is no longer the current title holder in the 800 meter have now let's move on to the next on our list which is fred kelly guys as you're watching this video i'll be happy to see you subscribe to this youtube channel now fred kelly it is so sad also that fred kelly did not even qualify for the final he was being defeated in the semi-final the african um tobogo defeated him and he was not even able to qualify for the final talk more or less of defending his title it was it was a very sad day for the usa superstar fred kelly he loses his title he is no longer the current world title champion he was being beaten by um no one has no one else is now the current world title champion now let's move on to the next on list which is shelly and phase of rise well her reason for for losing her title is quite understandable because even before this year could begin um shelly and phase of rise was complaining about injury 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 so i felt like maybe that's the reason why she was not able to defend her title it is so sad that the uh, jamaican superstar was being defeated by shakari richardson shakari richardson is now the current world title um defender because she has been she came third which is bronze and she did her best i think she, among like she did her best for coming third and taking the bronze it it ends that bad you know it ends that bad rather than taking nothing she was able to take bronze but she's no longer the current world champion so she was she failed to defend her title now let's move on to the next on our list which is toby amiozan one of the most popular athletes in africa entirely she has over 200 000 followers on facebook she is one of the most influential african athletes and it is so sad that she was able not she was not able to defend her title in Budapest 2023 and her reason for not depend, defending her title is quite understandable because we remember that um the world athletic board they suspended her which um i i mean it made her go through a lot of traumas and um she faced a lot of depression i'm i'm sure she faced a lot of depression because from the way she is running in world athletic you can clearly see it so the current um world champion holder is um the jamaican i think is it megan taper no it's not megan taper there is one um good athlete from jamaica i don't know her name you can comment down her name in the comment section now let's move to the next which is sifan hassan i think in 1500 meter she was not able to defend her title because she fell down almost at the end and i think the current world title holder is um the 
Kenyan Faith Kepinio. I don't even know how to pronounce her name. I'm so sorry. Don't be annoyed. So Sifan Hassan also loses her title, I think, in 1,500 meter or 1,000 meter, whatever. So she is no longer the current world champion. She has been beaten so sad. And what it pissed my heart because she did her best. But at the end, she fell down, and that was how she lost her title. Her title lost was very painful to me. Make sure to subscribe, guys, and let me know what you think in the comments.